Hey guys, I'm Courtney Novogratz and I've teamed up with Mo. Today I'm at Nora's apartment and we're gonna get rid of her college furniture and go to adulthood. Easy design tips that are inexpensive. So come, let's go meet Nora. I'm so excited that you're here right now. Great, can I see your bedroom? Please come in. Let's get started. So this is it. I, I love this bedroom set, but I've been wanting to redo it for a year. I'm not sure what direction to go in, so I'm so excited that you're going to come help me out with this. I love the size of this room, and the hardwood floors are beautiful, and I love that you like color. I mean, I, we love color, so Nora, we're going to definitely add a little more color, which will be fun. And your book collection, we can totally, you know, update that. Well, I think while you're at the office, I'm going to get started, and hopefully you'll come home to a big surprise. I can't wait. Yay! Let's get started. All righty. <laughs> so fast. Yeah, usually these older beds are kind of tricky, but it's coming apart pretty quick. Perfect, because Robert and I designed a new bed that's going to replace this old one, and you're going to put it together next. Awesome. I'm going to color coordinate the books, and I'll meet you outside. Okay, great. Okay. See you soon. One of my favorite design tips to update an old, inexpensive bookshelf is to color coordinate your books. It's as easy as that, and it makes it look super stylish. So here is the new bed that Robert and I designed. Oh, nice. And I think it's gonna be perfect because her old bed is so bulky and really dark and heavy. And this is kind of vintage inspired, but it's airy, it's a little more lighter. So I think it will make the room seem a lot larger. Opens it up a little bit. Yeah, right? exactly. Do you think you can put it together easily? What's cool about these beds is that they come with all the tools that you need. So I'll handle it. Okay. Probably in about 10 minutes. Perfect, I'll meet you upstairs. All right. Nora told me that she wanted her room to be more sophisticated, and so I chose these drapes because they're definitely sexier and more adult, and they definitely take away the LA sun when she needs it. When designing a bed, the pillowcases don't have to match. I do not like things to be matchy-matchy, so mix things up and have fun. Robert and I designed this pillow. It's at walmart.com for $15, and the bedding is a bed in a bag. You get the pillowcases, the bedspread, get some extra throw pillows, and have fun decorating. An easy design tip is to switch out your knobs. For a few dollars, you can upgrade your knobs and it makes this piece of furniture look brand new again. <gasps> Here you go! Oh my God. Welcome to your room. This is amazing. <laughs> oh my God, the books are color coordinated. Yes, and I love that you're a reader, but we had to do something stylish with all those books. I love this. So we replaced the rug that was here. Yeah. This one is definitely sexy, definitely grown up. Uh -huh. And we replaced your bed. The old one was really bulky and too big for the space and very heavy. Yeah. This is vintage inspired like this apartment. It's airier and bright. And we switched out your drapes. Uh -huh. These are like a perfect accent to the bright bedspread though. Uh, this yes. This looks amazing. And, and you changed these. These are so cute. Exactly. So by a simple upgrade to uh -huh. a nicer hardware, it makes this dress looks so expensive yeah. and it was an easy fix well I'm gonna let you get to get to bed or do whatever you do okay. so but thanks it was nice to meet you thank you so much congratulations thank you see you soon Nora's bedroom turned out great for very little money and very little time it looks high-end I hope I inspired you guys to go do this at home see you next time bye for more videos like this check out mode